Sailing in the Saronics has to be my favourite area since I started working for Sailing Holidays. The scenery is wonderful with beautiful mountain ranges, volcanoes, sheltered bays, beautiful beaches, ports and so many historic harbours. The wildlife here is amazing with lots of dolphins, fish, uh, turtles and the snorkelling has so many fantastic spots. What's great about this area from a sailing point of view, there's no tide to worry about. Uh, the wind builds through the day so there's a nice steady breeze most afternoons uh, and mixed out with sunny uh, cloudless days it makes for a perfect sailing holiday. Uh, the bays are beautiful, great spots to moor up and have your lunch with either a picnic uh, or eating at the tavernas. The holiday starts with a flight into Athens and a short transfer via the amazing Corinth Canal. Your yachts will be waiting for you at either Epidavros or Nepalon. We have some fantastic yachts to use when sailing around the Saronics. Everything from a Beneteau 31 footer up to a Beneteau 40 footer and up to a Bavaria 44 footer. We've got slab mains and furling mains, all with furling genoas. This makes for great family sailing, perfect for couples and groups. In the Saronics tour, uh, we've got some great little hops. Uh, starting from Napalon, when we go south down the coastline, we go through Astros, Tyros, Placa, as far down as Kiparissi, and maybe even just a little bit lower. Astros has a lovely little village behind it. Uh, there's some great restaurants in there, it's great shopping. Uh, the quay itself is very long, so we can always guarantee to fit the whole plot in there. We usually stern too, which makes great access on and off your yacht. Uh, and in the evening time, you can pop off the boats and enjoy the local environment. Blacker is a lovely spot. It's got some great historic elements to it. Uh, just a short walk from the yachts, there's a lovely golden beach where you can chill out on the sunbeds and enjoy your day. The Vari is just east of Napalon. Here we can free swing the yachts. There's some great tavernas, there's a beach, and there's loads of places to go shopping. Tiros is another beautiful fishing village just north of Placa and Sambatiki and it overlooks Spetsi. It's a small town but it's got a nice long beach with fresh showers available uh, on the beach itself. Uh, in the corner of the harbour there's a lovely little amphitheatre and really close to that there's a lovely cocktail bar where we like to go and enjoy the evenings. Belitza Creek is on Spetsi's Island and it's another very popular location. We tend to long line or raft up in this area, uh, although there is some spaces where we can go stern to uh, in the harbour. Motorised vehicles were banned on Spetsies uh, and there are very few today. The ideal way to get from the yachts into the main town is via horse and car, which is a spectacular journey. Spetsies is one of the larger places that we visit, so it's got a fantastic range of tavernas and it's great for shopping. Burmi only has both the North and the South Key. Uh, we can use either, but we tend to go on the South Key because it's uh, got some lovely quiet tavernas and some lovely quiet spots where we can go stern too. Burmi only is uh, a short hop from Hydra. When it's not too busy and we can get into Hydra on Hydra Island, uh, it's a great place to go and visit for the day. There's a huge amount of history here. There are some fantastic walks to explore the island. Boutiques and jewellery shops are abundant in Hydra, so take your credit card. 
Poros on Poros Island is another one of our locations that are very popular with the clients. The whole area is thriving with activity. We deal with sailing holidays from, from the very beginning that they appeared on the island. We love those people, we love the staff and the, the people, they keep coming back. Speaking about the seafood that we have in the restaurant, basically we have uh, fish from the Greek waters surround the island, like sea bass, like sea brims, red mallets, prawns, calamari, octopus, mussels, all kinds. One of the most popular activities on our Fertilla holiday is the beach barbecue that we can hold in various locations, one of which being Russian Bay, which is a beautiful little spot where we can free swing the yachts. When we free swing the yachts, it gives you a great opportunity to jump and swim off the back of your boats uh, while safely moored up in a tranquil little bay. In every flotilla we always like to go to somewhere like Angustry. Angustry is a great little town for shopping. Uh, it's got a small village, just a short walk away, but it also has some swimming pools which are nice for the kids to go up and enjoy some freshwater swimming and get the salt out of their hair. One of the great things about the Saronics is the huge amount of historical areas that there are to go and visit. One of the most spectacular historic sites here in the Saronics is the ancient amphitheater in Epidavros. That is a lovely little harbour with lots of turners situated along the quayside. One of the starting end points here in the Saronics is Pelea Epidavros. It's one of our turnaround bases and there's lots to do here. Sailing around the Saronics is an amazing experience. It makes for a great holiday for couples, families and groups of friends. It's truly the holiday of a lifetime. <laughs>